Hi, Jeff from Wisconsin Woodworking. I'm going to do the 2x4 challenge from Brian Guinea's uh, Summers Woodworking. And what I'm going to do is I'm actually getting ready for craft shows. And I'm going to be putting together little packages for kids. And what they are is self-assembly of little tiny cars out of 2x4s. Keeps them busy, keeps them out of the hair of the parents while camping. So I'm going to be selling them. I got three shows at uh, some campgrounds, and what I'm going to do is just build them, put them in a bag, and then they can go back to the uh, the camper and assemble it. So right now, what I got here is my 2 by 4 and I got a picture of two cars on here. I'm going to just do one of them. So I'm going to go cut that out on the bandsaw. So, and the thing is, I'm doing this on my smartphone. I don't have software for editing and, I don't know, <laughs> someday I guess. So what I'll do is, uh, I'll try to lay this phone here so you can see this. I might end up pausing it too so that, uh, you know, that way, that way I can just cut this out and then come back. Here, let me just pause it. Alright, I'm back. Uh, I'm still cutting this out. I do it one handed here. Jeez. Pretty hard when you do it one handed. Now, oh, I don't know why I'm still running. I hit the switch. All right, I said I didn't hit the switch hard enough. Next thing is the sandy edges. So let me turn on my dust collection. Throw some holes in where the wheels will go. I'm gonna peel this all off. And then the next step is to palm sand. So I'm just gonna sand this up real quick.
All right, now we got that done. Rounded over the edges with it and everything. That way the kids don't get slivers. Now we're gonna go back to the bandsaw. I made a little jig to cut the uh, axles out of quarter inch dowels. This is my jig. I need a three inch axle, so I made a 90 degree on a piece of well, three quarter inch stock pine, made my mark at three and cut it. So I just gotta run over there and make two axles real quick. Hopefully you saw that. Alright, this is kind of hard doing it with a smartphone. Alright, now the assembly. Just put the axle through on each end. And then, let me hang on. Oh geez, tires going everywhere. Got little tires. And what we're gonna do, we're gonna glue these on. So, we'll glue these on now. All I need is just a little glue on the dowel. Just a little something. Spin it around as we go. Make it flush right here. And a little more glue. Let that one sit. Space out your axle so it looks about the same on both sides. It's gonna roll anyways, but uh, you know for appearance. So there you go. I got the four wheels on. They're all glued up. I got the shape of the car. All that's left is to paint it. So like I said, these are just kits that are gonna go into a Ziploc bag. And it's for something for, you know, little kids, five years old, six years old, to do while they're camping to put it together. I'll throw, like, these little glue packs that, you you know, you can buy them by the hundreds. Throw just one of them little glue packs in there, and they're done. I mean, it's just something. And then they can play with this while they're camping. It keeps them busy out of their parents' hair. So that's my 2 by 4 challenge for Brian. Um... I don't have that printout, Brian. Um, I downloaded it, and I don't know where it went. But anyways, this is for your 2x4 challenge. Jeff Vandenberg, Wisconsin Woodworking. Have fun. Make sawdust. Take care.